hello potatoes it's kato potato and welcome back to another video so in today's video we're just gonna be doing my makeup i'm trying to get ready and so just be a chatty get ready with me i didn't know that's what c g r w m stood for but it was like come get ready with me or chill get ready with me i don't know but apparently it's chatty and so clearly i talk a lot so i thought in today's video i'm just gonna be getting ready um i had some interesting things happening this morning so i'm having to suddenly get ready um i don't have to get ready but i just want to get ready I'm going out with lunch with my mom. <laughs> Get on into it. Well, let me start doing my makeup. I'm going to start off with primer, just using the e.l.f. one. So this morning, I was supposed to be going to jury duty, or apparently not. I wasn't supposed to apparently go. Um, so I got a jury summons around two weeks to a month ago. I don't really remember the time frame, but I remember I had enough time to where I could submit it to my job. So I can be off for today. When you get the summons, you don't exactly know if you're going to be picked or not. So I figured that, you know, that meant you get you get told whether you're picked or not when you go to the thing. Which I feel like in and of itself, like, I think that is something that they do. But didn't realize that was a preliminary step before then. Basically, in the letter, you're supposed to call, like, the night before after 7 p.m., which I'm like, if I have a jury summons at on Monday, which today is Monday at 8.30, I'm really going to call <laughs> this number at 7 p.m. on a Sunday? I don't know. It just, like, what? I'm just going to be using the Morphe 2 Hint Hint Skin Tint in the color. Am I just blind? Can I not? Oh, okay. Hint of Beige. Cause I'm beige. <laughs> and also, of course, like I'm 20. I a lot of people around my age haven't ever gone for jury duty. And so I was literally asking like my boyfriend's mom like what I should do. And she was like, Yeah, you just check in there and then they basically tell you whether you need to stay all day or not. And I was like, okay. And so I go. If I look up just on a like regular day, probably if I look it up right now, it'll take me like 25 minutes to get to where I went today. But this morning i left at 7 15 trying to get there early and i got there at 8 15. it took me an hour it took me twice the amount of time because there was so much traffic thank goodness i accounted for that because what would have been worse if i was actually supposed to be there and i was late um but i parked in this parking lot which i had like this pass for and then there was a bus like just randomly in the middle but i like literally pulled out my jury summons because there was nothing on there about a bus. I was so confused, but everyone else was getting on this bus. And so I got in, could have been an awful decision by the way. Like I could have just been easily kidnapped, which I like, that's a scary thing. We'll get to that in a little bit. I've also been bouncing in this foundation for an unnecessarily amount of time. Cause I'm just like, ah! cause I'm so upset from this morning. Um, but yeah, basically I get onto this bus and then I can tell that everyone else also has a jury summons paper. I was like, okay, I'm in the right spot, whatever. Um, we start driving on this bus, we'll go and then the bus stops and then everyone just starts getting off. And I was like, okay, I guess I just get off here. Um, I get off, I just follow a group of crowd, which again, bad, horrible decision. I should have looked where I was going, but I just walk in into the place. Uh, it says I need to go on the seventh floor and I try to get out of the line, but then this police officer is like, no, you need to be in this line for security. And I was like, okay, I, I don't even know if I'm in the right building whatever um i walk in they do the whole security thing that's fine i go upstairs to the seventh floor and then i already did the online check-in and then i go up to the person who is supposed to check me in and then they're like oh you're not supposed to be here today i was like what do you mean i'm not supposed to be <laughs> i didn't react like that i promise i was like like i thought i was supposed to show up and then she was like no if you had called the night before at 7 p.m you would have known that they only need a group one and two today and you're in group three and i was like of course of course of course i guess i'm gonna use the kathleen lights one take my you guys, you guys can see I'm so nervous that i started peeling off my peelies while on the right there because i was just, just so nervous but yeah basically I get told like, hey, you didn't have to come in. And I was like, okay. And she, and she was like, do you need an excuse? And I went ahead and said yes, even though I already got today off um, because of my original jury summons, um, like sheet of paper. Um, but I still got the excuse. And then on the way back, I was like, well, shoot, how am I gonna get back to my car 
if I come here on a bus. And so my two options are to call up an Uber or a Lyft, whatever is available and nearest me, um, or to walk. Um, which I don't know if you guys have like ever been in Atlanta before, but like it's terrifying <laughs> to be in any proximity of that city in a car, much less walking on the sidewalk. And so I was just like, you know what, I, I'm angry. So if everyone tries to abduct me today, we're going to have some issues. And so I was like, you know what, I'll just walk. And so I walked like 15, 20 minutes and I thought it was gonna be cold today. And so I bundled up in so many different layers, but also trying to make it look like I was like cat casual, like business professional. I was soaked by the time I got to my car. Like I was drenched in sweat. I literally had to change. I'm literally in a short sleeve shirt cause it's so, so hot right now. I'm burning up. Um, so yeah, that was a fun experience. I ended up getting to my car. I call my boyfriend and he's like, well, I guess just have fun having a day off. So I just called up my mom and thankfully she had some time off today. And so we're gonna go get lunch together. I thought I was gonna do like a like a sit down, like true makeup video, not one where I'm like upset about having to come home early. I feel like regardless of if you're like a big YouTuber or not, there's still something always fun about like, now I'm taking the tower twin, like, you know, like it's fun to like take some makeup products. I'm sure people do it on a regular, even when there's no camera rolling, they'll be like, I'm taking this product that I've had definitely for a really long time, but you know. Okay, do not recommend that you do this, but since it's the only thing that's really near me right now, I'm literally taking the tapers that I use for stretching my ears. Basically, I literally take a small applicator. I'm taking this product, it's by Juvia's Place, it's Bronze Toast, which I'll pop up the picture that I thought I was the color that I was getting, which I thought was gonna be so much darker, but it's, it's very light. I don't love the color on my lips. And also I'm pretty sure Juvia's Place had some anti-Asian hate going on for a while, um, but I got this beforehand. I thought about like throwing away this product, but since I already have it, I'm just gonna go ahead and use that. But I'm literally just taking my taper. For a while I was like, oh no, I only need to use like freckle product. I have this like Lime Crime Freckle Pen. Like it, because it's like more of a felt pen kind of applicator, it kind of becomes like big circles on your face and, and then it kind of just looks more like blemishes versus this is actually giving me like tiny little dots. So what's the point of this video? Make sure to check that you do have jury duty the night before, because apparently that's something that you have to check. I stupidly did not, and I essentially just wasted a lot of time and gas on going, which it's fine. It's so cute, I love it. And then I guess I'll be taking a nice catch. This is the Lime Crime Lip Plushies in the color Melon Smoothie. But there we go, there's the finished makeup. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know it's kind of all over the place, but I just needed to have something to let my feelings out because this morning just didn't go the way that I wanted to. So hopefully you enjoyed me just kind of spewing a bunch of different things, just talking about life and also just doing my makeup. Um, if you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below. I don't know, tell me how your day was. Let's just all, just all share our days together. Hopefully we can start off this, start off this week strong. So yeah. Subscribe down below for more interesting content like this and hope you have a great day. Wishing you the best as always. Kato, rolling on out.